You can see the alive ula in all of those wetland spaces, and even in parking lots in Kailua town. Hi, my name's Mari. I'm a fifth grader at Wailai Elementary School. This is our school mural of the Alai Ula or native Hawaiian moorhen. Did you know the Alai Ula is a small water bird native to our neighborhood and it's endangered? There are only about a thousand left. According to a Hawaiian legend, fire was brought to the people of Hawaii by the Alai Ula, which explains their red foreheads, a symbol of the scorching from the fire. Despite their history during the 20th century, their population declined dramatically and the species became endangered. Threats to the Alai Ula have come from both humans and other animals. The Alai Ula historically had a few predators. They had the pueo and the um, alku'u, which is the night heron. Over time, though, as people came, they brought more predators with them, like the cats, rats, mongoose. They also brought turtles, frogs, and so the list just keeps growing and growing, in addition to just human activities. In recent years, the population has been stable or increasing thanks to predator control and habitat management efforts. There's like a bunch of different things people are doing. Um, the main one is that they're caring for these spaces. So they protected like James, Cap James Campbell National Wildlife Refuge, Hamakua Marsh, Kavai Nui, Ka'ela Pulu, all of these wetland spaces are now being managed and cared for by somebody. You can see the Alai Ula in all of those wetland spaces and even in parking lots in Kailua town. This is Mar Yamamoto from Waialai Elementary Public Charter School for Hikino on PBS Hawaii.